What's good YouTube? In this video, we'll be taking a look at how to change and customize Siri settings on your iPhone. If you find this kind of content helpful, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching. So first we'll get started by seeing how to access the Siri settings. What you want to do is go into your settings app and then you want to scroll down until you see Siri and search. Once you hit Siri and search, you'll be prompted with the settings for Siri, and we'll just go over them one by one here. The first one is, of course, listen for Hey Siri. This is when the iPhone is always turned on to listen for Hey Siri, so you can prompt that with your voice to activate Siri. Next, of course, is to press the side button for Siri, which means holding down the side power button in order to activate Siri. Next, you have the language settings for Siri, and you can change it to various languages that are available by default on your iPhone. And of course, next we have the voice for Siri. Here you can switch between six different varieties of voices for English and four different voices for each variety for Siri. After that, we have Siri responses. And here you can adjust when Siri will respond to you, either always when silent mode is off or when Hey Siri is turned on. You can also show if Siri captions, that's when Siri actually dictates out in words on your iPhone screen what the response is on your iPhone. And also always show speech, which also shows a transcription of what you're saying to Siri on your iPhone as well. Next, we have announce calls. There, you can change when Siri will let you know who is calling and the phone number that is calling. You can change it from always, when you have headphones and when you're in your car, when you only have headphones on, and of course, never. After that, you can change when Siri will announce notifications. Here, you can turn on if Siri will tell you what the notification is and when the notification comes in. If you turn this on, you'll notice a lot more options that are available to you, including prompting to activate this feature only when headphones are on, and also to be able to reply without confirmation of your notifications. You can also adjust which notifications this applies to you from the list of apps that are available to you in this menu as well. Next, we have Siri and dictation history. Here you can choose to delete the Siri and dictation history from your phone. After that, you have content from Apple, which includes show and lookup and show and spotlight. This is when Apple will show you content when you are searching for text or there's something in the photos or your searches that prompts some information from Apple. Next are suggestions from Apple. Here you can get suggestions from Apple through your notifications, your app library and spotlight, when sharing and also when listening. So there you have it everyone, just some quick settings that you can, you can use to customize how Siri behaves on your iPhone. If you found this video helpful, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.